Price discrimination. Price discrimination is a strategy which attempts to increase profits by charging different prices for the same product. First degree discrimination means charging a different price for every good sold. At price P4, consumer surplus is the whole area under the price line. If the firm discriminates with two new prices, P3 and P2, the firm gains consumer surplus which it converts into producer surplus. In this way, producer surplus can be increased as more prices are added. But it is very difficult to apply in practice. Second degree discrimination means charging different prices for different quantities. So, unit prices for single products will be higher than those contained in multipacks. Third degree discrimination is the most common type and occurs when different submarkets can be identified. Once identified, each submarket must have a different PED. When PED is low and inelastic, profit maximizing price is high. But when PED is high and elastic, profit maximizing price is much lower. When submarkets can be kept apart, say through time or place, discrimination is possible, as with peak time travel tickets which are sold at higher prices than off-peak tickets. In this example, profits from separating a market into an inelastic submarket and an elastic one are greater than from combining the market. For convenience, MC is assumed constant and equal to AC. Profit maximization in each market is where the MR for each submarket equals the common MC. Here, supernormal profits X plus Y are greater than Z, so price discrimination is beneficial.